Alternate tunings on guitar can be a great way to inspire new music and learn new chord voicings. You may have heard of such alternate tunings as drop D, How about Dadgad? Or maybe Open G? I'm Scott Poley, I'm a session guitarist and pedal steel player. I also produce and write music, and in this video I'm going to show you some more unusual alternate tunings for guitar. Now I'm going to show you these examples on acoustic guitars, but they work equally well on electric guitars too. Now I mentioned dadgad tuning in the intro. An alternative to dadgad tuning that I use a lot is a tuning called Double Drop D or D A D G B D. It's a really versatile tuning that has a lot of the flavor of dadgad tuning, but allows you to use more regular chord shapes. And it sounds like this. This next tuning was inspired by one of my guitar heroes and also now one of my dearest friends. Kara Luft is an incredible singer-songwriter from Canada. I urge you to go and check out her music. But one of her songs, Come All You Sailors, is in the tuning D-A-D-D-A-D, -D -D -A -D, which sounds like this. <laughs> Another one of my heroes, sadly we lost him recently, the great singer-songwriter from The Birds and Crosby, Stills and Nash, of course, David Crosby. Now David Crosby is well known for writing a bunch of his most famous songs in a really unusual tuning called Ebedgad, or E-B-D-G-A-D. It's featured on the songs Deja Vu, on Guinevere, and many other of his songs. And it sounds like this. <laughs> If you're getting value out of this video, I would love it if you consider taking the time to like the video, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell icon because it really helps me and it helps you know when I release new videos as well. Carry on with the tunings. This one is inspired by Crosby, Stills and Nash also, in this case, Stephen Stills. The song Carry On was written in a really unusual tuning with lots of E's. The tuning is E, 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 B, E. Another fabulous singer-songwriter, the great Nick Drake, wrote many of his songs in this really unusual guitar tuning, which is C-G-C-F-C-E. Thank you. 
This next tuning is closely related to the Nick Drake tuning. In fact, it's only one string that's changed up by a tone. The great Joni Mitchell wrote the song Coyote in the following tuning. If you've not come across the song, go and check it out. It's on the album Hijera with the great Jaco Pistorius on bass. What a song, what a songwriter. The tuning is C G D F C E. This final tuning was inspired by the great Lindsay Buckingham from Fleetwood Mac and specifically the song Never Going Back Again. Now when I play Never Going Back Again night after night on tour with rumours of Fleetwood Mac that I play with live, I use this tuning which is C, G, D, G, B, E. So just the bottom two strings of the guitar are changed, the rest of them are a standard tuning. It makes the song a lot easier to play. Lindsay Buckingham supposedly recorded it in drop D tuning but this tuning makes it a lot easier. It's also a really creative tuning and I've written a couple of songs in the tuning since. So I thought I'd share it with you. It sounds like this. Thanks so much for watching. If you've got any other tunings that you think I or the other people watching this video should check out, please leave them in the comments below. I'd love it if you consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel, and I'll catch you next time.